Well, it's about time for another review, boys. In this episode, I'm going to share my experience with Applied AI course since a lot of folks have reached out to me regarding the same. We are going to break down this episode into four different aspects. The course syllabus, the prerequisites required to take the course, what is the price of the course, definitely it's a paid course, and should you take it or not. Based on these aspects, I'll share my experience whether you should go ahead with this course, spoiler alert, and we'll also see what are the outcomes that you can expect after taking this course. So let's dive into it. All right, so here I am on the appliedaicourse.com and as you can see, this is what we'll be looking for going ahead. We'll deep dive into everything. So Applied AI course basically provides a lot of different courses. Uh, so, but we are going to focus on the applied machine learning course. Uh, that's where they actually started, but they also have the courses, but we are not going to focus them uh, in this video. Maybe we can, I can share them going ahead. But since I took the applied machine learning course, so we'll go into this one. And going forward, the first thing that we're going to discuss is the curriculum. So curriculum is really exhaustive. They have uh, they have covered a lot of things in detail. So by the way, this is an online course. Uh, it's completely self-paced, but you'll definitely need some huge amount of internet to basically complete this. Okay, so this is the syllabus that we have. Uh, they've covered a lot of things and they keep on adding things as they go forward. But uh, 80 or the 90% of the things that I read or I learned when I took this course in 2019 are more or less the same, but they have uh, added a few things into it. So they basically start with the fundamentals of programming. They uh, teach Python and SQL. The mode of the course, basically it's, uh, it's in English. Then they go with the standard EDA process, all the topics you can see. And uh, then they go ahead with the standard machine learning, some NLP problems, machine learning supervised, then unsupervised. They also cover a lot of case studies in this one. And that's that's the best part I would say about this course. They also touch up on neural networks, but it's not covered uh, exhaustively. I would say this course is definitely based around if you want to learn the basics of machine learning in the first place. Then they have some other topics that you can definitely look ahead, uh, like sample interview. You have the machine learning higher level design, some introduction to reinforcement learning. But as I said, this course is basically defined around the basics of machine learning and that uh, you can expect to learn from this course. So that's that's about the curriculum. Coming to the price of so the price, as you can see, it's 25,000 plus GST. So this course uh, comes around at 29,500 Indian national rupees. So uh, the third point that we wanted to cover was the prerequisites required. So, so although it says that uh, no prerequisite is required, but in my experience, I would say that if you have some basic understanding about Python, then uh, it's going to feel a little bit easier and uh, you might be able to complete this course than uh, the average time taken by anybody. The validity of this course is basically one year. They give you one year to complete the course along with the theory or the video material as well as the assignments. So coming to the assignments, they have uh, like, uh, where is it? Yeah, so they have uh, 30 practical assignments and along with they have 13 end to end case studies. Apart from this, after completing all these 43 things, what you need to do is they'll ask you to prepare two self case studies as well. One would be based on machine learning and the other would be based on deep learning. And those case study will definitely go into your portfolio. Upon completing these uh, 30, 40 assignments and the self, self case studies, there would be a mentor that would be assigned to you and that mentor would be uh, helping you throughout building your portfolio and helping you throughout, you know, uh, completing your case studies and building the portfolio in the end. The query resolution, so there's uh, the, the team that helps you throughout the course and uh, uh, the response from the team is within 24 hours. I would definitely say it's less than 24 hours. You'll definitely uh, hear from the team if you have some uh, queries. You can hear from them in like five or six hours. So that's uh, one of the best things I had. In the end, you get a course completion certificate that uh, looks like this. Now, um, a drawback that I would say is that uh, it's not a registered degree low so it's not like a master or a diploma it's just a course and you get a, a course a certificate of completion and that's it but what can you expect in 30 30000 rupees right uh, it's really good so we have discussed uh, three aspects uh, we have discussed the syllabus we have discussed the prerequisite required and we have discussed the price now before coming to my final call if you should take it or not i mean i took it uh, there's another thing that you will really love so th they have this program that's called the job guarantee program and uh, uh, this job guarantee program states that if you uh, if you have completed all the assignments assigned to you like the 30, 30 43 assignments you have completed and you have completed the self case studies that are assigned to you upon that they will give you six months 
that uh, they assure you that they will get you placed in any of the company within the defined analytics role. So it could be a data scientist role, it could be a, a data analyst role or a machine learning role. So anything related to AI or machine learning. If they are not able to land you into uh, in, into an analytics job in the next six months upon completing all the assignments and everything, then they'll return the money or the course fee that you have paid. Yes, that's right. And that's the best thing about this course. You don't have anything to lose. Uh, you, are, you are basically, this is, this is just an investment. One thing I would like to uh, tell you on my experience that this course is not easy. Uh, by easy, I mean uh, the mode of communication is easy. The way the things are explained, they are easy. But uh, it really takes some hard work and some dedication to complete it. So they actually give you like 12 months to complete this course uh, from starting from the registration and paying the fees. And, and, and the average time taken is around six or seven months to complete the course. I was able to complete it in uh, in, in, in less than like five months so that's where you need to prepare a proper schedule for this and stick to it so they're even they're going to help you to create a schedule with this so if you click on this uh, schedule button up here you can fill all the details in this one and uh, then they'll create a schedule for you on how you can follow the syllabus and it will be helpful to you to uh, go ahead and complete the course in the given timeline now the final thing if you should take it or not or you know what are the other competitors so there are other competitors like simply learn or springboard they provide this kind of course first thing is this the, the price that they provide is quite higher than we are what we are seeing at applied ai course and second thing i don't think they explain everything in that detail that has been uh, shared up here or you know taught here so applied ai course has created more than 150 uh, hours of videos and they have created like 30 assignments that are really uh, helpful and they are made out of the real world scenarios so that you can be prepared for the interviews and everything and also they are so nice that they have put up my success story in this one as well so this is a little something that you can catch up on but upon my final verdict if you if you are really interested in the machine learning side and if you are really into you know mathematics so mathematics is really important for this course if you if you don't like mathematics i would suggest not to go for this course mathematics uh, is going to be implemented because that's the core of uh, machine learning and deep learning if you only want to learn deep learning then i, I would not suggest this course for you uh, maybe go ahead and learn something of edx or coursera or something get a nano degree maybe I, I i don't know but if you want to start from the scratch you learn python then sql then uh, the basics of machine learning do some assignments and finally land on deep learning and build a really amazing project out of it then this course is really really great 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 and you should definitely go ahead with that i mean come on you don't have anything to lose right if you complete all the assignments you have the knowledge that's going to uh, help you in in your all, all your endeavors forward but if, if they are not able to help you land a job in six months, you'll get your money back. I mean, you don't have anything to lose. The safest investment ever that I had. I mean, this was my first investment and it was worth every penny. So let me know your thoughts on this. Uh, what do you think? If you still have any doubt, then uh, maybe write up some questions on the comment section of this video. You can maybe reach out to my LinkedIn profile uh, that's mentioned in the video as well as uh, I'll, I'll mention it in the description as well hope you guys learn something from my experience and i'll catch you guys in the next one bye bye